Hey guys, how's it going? Cross here. Gonna do some uh, boss fish um, hunting, pursuit of the largest. So let's, um, let's set it up, set up our tackle. Let's have a look what we're gonna use. I've just unlocked these um, Sonic S4 carp rods with the cork handles. I like the, I like the cork handle ones. And what I've done, I've also switched my reels from the big, the big Sonic Tornos 10,000s back down to the Sonic 6,000s. Um, just, just see if that makes a difference. chat one second so yeah so i've switched that what i'm trying to do is i'm trying to unlock the um the purple line i've got the the 15 pound purple line but i want the uh the the, the 20 the 20 pound purple line which is the so i'm gonna have to unlock this one first this blue one to be able to get to that so I think I'm going to need at least 6,000. So I've got three, six. We'll uh, pop back when I've caught a few fish and we'll unlock that. Then we'll rejig the tackle and uh, start again. So, tackle box. I'm going to go on Bravo. Uh, my tackle box is set up for Bravo. And... Um, Let's catch a few fish, then we'll pop back here, like I said, by that line. And we may move on to Foundry in the second hour, see how it goes. Let's go on Bravo, let's change these settings. I'm going to leave it on long day, summer. Um, let's change this to three hours. No limit. Tackle box one. Apply that. Let's start. So I believe I've seen last few days a lot of videos knocking about with this um, underwater glitch that's been found. Um, we may have a look at that. Uh, we'll have a look which way the wind's blowing first and which area we're going to fish. Then possibly go underwater, have a look what the the bottoms like in that area so we can see where where our bait's going to be lying um so let me teleport here let's have a look which way the wind's blowing first so the wind is blowing to that opposite bank there So I'm going to be cat. I'm going to fish from this side, and I'm going to cast across. So I'm tempted to actually use the glitch and have a look what the bottom's like. So let's move up and. I know it's pretty much a, a well-known, well-known glitch now, so might as well have a look at it. Doesn't let you catch any fish. You can see the fish, but you can catch fish underwater. But it's, it doesn't really give you any advantage. The only thing I like about it is you can actually see uh, what the bottom's like where you're going to be fishing. Let's uh, see if we can climb up this bivvy. What I think what you have to do is you have got to walk up the bivvy somehow. Gradually walks up it. There you go. Climbing up it now. 
You've just got to be careful that you don't fall off the other side like that. Let's go around again. Oh, can you believe it? Fell off again. I think it's because I, I, I try and rush by fast walking up it. Instead of just taking my time. Like that. So we'll, we'll jump in. Oh, I've not done it anywhere. I'll have more on. I don't think it'll be long before dovetail patch of this. So where I'm gonna fish, let's run up the lake and have a look at the bed where I'm gonna be putting my bait. So it does give you a good, uh, good idea. Where the, the deep spots are. But where I'm, I'm going to be fishing. Across to this big rock. So here, I'm going to fish from that opposite side there, across to here, and this is where I'm going to be trying to get it as tight as I can up to this wall, because I think it does make a difference, like, we're going to be fishing up, up against that wall, all three rods, although sometimes I like to put a rod this bit round here over here because there's a gravel patch I think that might be the gravel patch though so I put a gravel rig on here put my bait there put rod one there and rods two and three in front of that um, in front of that big rock and fish from I think it's this peg here what was that fish then oh, wait, there's one of the uh, ghosties so, and if you're wondering how do you get back out, because you can't just walk out. What I do is I go up to, uh, I've got to walk back down here. Because it won't let you out the, um, out the bank by just walking up it. So what you do is you go up to just go up to one of the um, notice boards. When you get your your icon for quick travel, just hit that, and then respawn somewhere else. So you're out you're out the water. You're back to normal. Um, so we're going to fish this peg. This is where we've just been opposite, having a look. Just fix my headphones. Wondering why I've no sound, I've got them switched on. So yeah, so we're gonna fish this one and we're gonna that's where we was looking then. Against that rock. And then the other other spot is over there. So let's set these rods up. Gotta put a gravel rig on this one. With mm,
I'm going to put the, the dumbbell on that, I think. And we'll put this one out here. That'll be a bit hard, that. Way too hard. So let's just reel it back a little bit, get on that gravel. Like that. Set two up. This one I'm going to put a four on, I think. Size four with a 20 mil tiger nut. Pop up. And we're going to put that as tight as we can up against that wall. It's only a short cast. Three. We'll put the dumbbell, the sinking dumbbell on this one. Same again, up tight up against that wall. Now that rod two's moving, so whether it's sliding down the uh, the slope a bit, now we've seen the bottom, what the bottom's like. It's not like flat or anything. Oh, we've got to run on three though. So I think the first hour I'm going to do on here, catch a few fish, hopefully, a boss or two, and then second hour I'm going to do one foundry, once we've unlocked that 20 pound line. Big bream. Eight pound bream. I'm going to reset that rod too. Set that one. Still, that's not as close as I'd like it. Let's see if I can get it a little bit closer. a bit closer anyway now that this is going to be a one pound roach you can see it happening don't know what they've changed 
to uh, cause this, but like you're getting one pound roach on a big chunky 20 mil tiger nut. Here we go, Rob one's going. Oh, Rob two. Noisy neighbours. I'll swap the two before it gets off. Sorry about that guys, stream went down then for a second, I don't know what happened. Just saw, I don't know if my internet connection dropped, dropped or what, but it, it went down. So yeah, sorry about that. We're back up and running anyway. So yeah, I've just lost that fish then, that was a boss. Tried to do the old uh, dip the rod technique where you could just keep reeling and you'd get the fish in no matter what. And it, obviously they've, they've changed that since they did the update. Uh, so that no longer works. But never mind. Right, which rod am I on here? I'm using rod 2. So let's recast rod 2. Let's try and get it close to that wall again. That's better. That's much better. Sliding down in r rather than dropping a few feet away from it. Right, let's have a look at three. see what this fish is on Rob oh, just about to pick Rob one up and we've got to run on two I suppose it's better, They've, they have made it a little bit more uh, tricky to get the fish in. That's going to get off, it's going to get off. Off. one in it's a little common so that's on 
size 6. And I'm going to change it to uh, Tiger Nut. Go, here we go. One. That worked quicker. That's Rob two going. Not sure, because I can't see. No, Rob three. As soon as this one's given up. The new map, mate, is uh, it's all right. I'm going to be playing it after this one. I'm just trying to get some some tackle points to buy some better line to use on it let's just get this uh let's get this one in Come on, fish. There we go. Let's pick that rod two up. Yeah, the new um, the new DLC Foundry Lake. It's uh, it's good. I don't. It, it's a bit. It's a bit featureless. Because it's a, a dock, it's a marina. But it's different. It's something different to give a go when you obviously when you've played the original five a lot. Nice to play something a little bit different. Let's get these in. See what we've been given. They're not very big these, but I'm not bothered about that. I just need the tackle points.
might go quick. Pick up two. Come on, come on, come on. Right, what's going on here? Right, this is stripping line. This could be a boss. Maybe not. Oh, it's far from a boss. Thought it was taking line then, but obviously. It's giving up. What is it? Is it roach? Bream? It's a big roach. Is it boss roach? Because it looks decent size. 3.2 ounce roach. Not a boss, but it's a good size roach. How many have we had? Seven fish. Not very much weight wise. Get a few more and then we'll go and get these tackle points. Get this line sorted.
catch a few more and then we'll uh, go back to menu that rod two is still moving tempted to change pegs that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna I'm gonna close this peg I'm gonna move let's follow this wind <clears throat> I think the wind is actually blowing it down that channel though I'm gonna fast travel. I'm gonna try down here. a short cast here. Oh, look at that. I've just changed from a gravel rig. Find gravel straight away. Nope. Straight away. So I've followed the wind and looks like the fish should follow the wind too. A bit better, twenty one. So this time I'm gonna switch back to that gravel rig. See that was a little gravel patch there then. Let's see if I can find it again. Two out. It's gravel there as well.
baits are moving around a lot on the bottom. Look at that. Rod 2 again. Just shifting. I'm going to put gravel rig on that as well. No, Rod 3 is moving. I'm Rod 1. Now I'm fish, 100 pounds. Couple more and then go back and use them tackle points. Right, well that one didn't make it any better by changing it to gravel, so... Let's go back to silt. if that makes a difference. Well, there's not much happening. I thought after that first fish straight away then would be a good spot, but... Right, I'm going to pick Rod 3 up. something Let's see if we can get some of it from the uh, the margin it's very gravelly Let's 
See if anything comes up. No fish in here. Oh, got a run. Well, two. Line physics are a bit a bit off as well. Oh my goodness. Damn you fish. Damn you. Losing a lot of fish these days since this uh, update. I think it's been updated since I went away. I've just had a week off streaming while I was on holiday. I think it's been updated while I've been gone. It's been changed. See if anything comes up. Nothing showing.
Or two's moving again. Rob one's going. So I'm just wondering if this line is a bit light for this lake since they've, they've updated it. Because it's just 15 pound line, it seems to be. Uh, We should get enough. This is the boss. This is a boss fish. Maybe not. I don't know though, it's going. Still going. Seventy yards out. It's taking me into the main lake. Where is it going? Where are you going, fish? Oh my goodness, it's going right back of the island. Right back of that um that point. coming back definitely on its way back Fingers crossed I get this in because this is the biggest fish of the session. I see a tail then. Oh yeah, it's a... I thought it might have been a, a cat, but I don't think it is. It's a boss. Which one is it? It's a nice big mirror. Fat boy. Let's get a screenshot of fat boy. 52.4. Nice fish. Let's let him go. So that's just done as a few tackle points anyway. Just 
just off that gravel. Nothing coming up. Oh, there we go. Saw a cart then come up. One time you could bring them right up in the water. Oh, there we go. Rob one again. Trying to get off. It's nothing big though. It's in the net. All gravel, though. change this to the same setup as I've got on one so I've got KD4 pop up tagging up
It's in the net. and I'll have pop up dumbbell on this one So just the one boss fish, fat boy, 52 pounder. fish give us a bite now well, let's reset one one's drifting <laughs> two's definitely drifted Let's reset that
definitely quiet. Just wondering if I've already got enough points. Give it a few more minutes and then we'll close this peg and go back to uh, tackle shop. this up let's check out how many points I've got let's go back oh not got anywhere near enough need 6,000 for that So let's go to tackle. I'm going to change that to a six IQ KD. We've got KD and IQ four, and I'm going to change these a couple of these bits, and then we can go on. Um, Foundry. I'm going to put the IVs on it. Seems to work alright. Activate. So I've got two 18 mils, 15, and a 20. Two size 6 rigs and two size 4s. Starting time. I think I'm going to start evening. Fish through the night. I still need that 20 point line. Spawn in and see which way this wind's blowing. Uh, wind's blowing across this way. So.
Oh. Grab one scone. Two's gone. Two's at the other side. This could be a big fish. Maybe not, it's coming in a bit too easy. It's not a boss, it's a bit easy coming to the net. Big bream. Let's put that back out first. Got on Rob One. Leather. It's full of leather carp this this lake. Big tagonal on this one. Rob one again. Seems to be the favourite.
where he's going. Two's just shot off. Come on, pick three up, quick. I think it's a bit of a nighttime place this Come on, let's pick two up before it goes off. Right, two's in the net. Bream again. Stinky Bream. Right, so what have we got on here that this Bream's attracted to? It likes this fish meal boiler. So I'm going to switch to the high vis. this one it's a better fish twenty three Three, what have we got here? Another leather.
Got that one in the net. Just a little common. So what was that on? That's on a that's on the IVIS. Swap that round as well. Oh my goodness, look at the state of that. That would be a live bait for a big cat. Or a pike. So what was that on? That was on size 6 KD with a 15mm high vis. I don't, I don't think we're going to... It doesn't really matter what size bait we put on because these little roach seem to be taking everything. Let's stick with that. Come on, fish. I suppose since it's been updated you've got to be a little bit more patient the uh, the bites seem to be more random the you know the time the time between each bite Coming a bit easy. Another bream, man. Oh, 
and of Ibrahim. Don't know what this is. This is probably a soggy bream as well, the way it's coming in. Or a roach. Oh my god, it's a roach again. A bit bigger though. Three point two inch roach. On eighteen mil dumbbell pop up. Got to be another roach. Seriously, what's going on here? Look at the size of that. One pound roach. Caught on. Size six, 15 mil boiler. It was definitely fishing better than this. Um, the day this map was released, because I think they've uh, they've done something to it after that was released. Seriously, man, what's going on here? Another roach. I'm going to cast this with the wind which is blowing that way. <laughs> the Mental Defective League in formation. <laughs> oh. Dunsmore, thanks for the subscribing, mate. Much appreciated. Lisa Jane, thanks very much. We 
do a lot better if we could stop catching these roach. What's going on? There we go. This is going to be another roach. Rod two. Coming in a bit easier. It's gonna be another. <laughs> oh, David, thanks a lot, mate. Much appreciated. Now this isn't a roach. It seems to be. Putting a, a bit more of a fight. It's not massive though. Right. What is it? It's a carp, yes. It's a mirror. It's not a big one. At least it's not a roach. Let's get that one back out there. Now this is definitely a roach or a bream. Just came in like a soggy bag. Oh look at the size, they're just getting smaller. What's that on? I think I'd sooner have the bream than uh, these little tiny roach. So we'll switch back to the uh, activate fish meal boiler. Come on, fish. I wonder if should try spotting. Worth a try, I suppose. See if we can uh, attract some better, better fish. Nope. Oh. This is coming in way too easy as well.
Now this seems a bit better. It's 80 yards out. Still going. It's not a roach anyway, but it's not. I don't think it's a boss. Scrapping, scrapping under the uh, under the rod tip. Is it? Put up a bit of a fight anyway. Oh, that's a lot better than a one pound roach. 23.11. And that was on IQD4. 18 mil dumbbell pop up. Pathetic excuse for a fish we've got on this one. A roach. Another roach. A little bit bigger than that one pounder. It's a two pounder. Two pound four. Rod's that, rod one. Coming in a bit easy. Coming in a bit too easy. Oh, this is ridiculous. Close the peg and I'm going to change something. Let's go over here and change these lines. I'm going to change it to the corder green on all three. I'm going to 
to get rid of that one. And I'm going to go with the... Fifteen mil sinker. See if this line makes a difference. Which one's going? I think it's... Nah, I'm not, not from Manchester, mate. Wigan. Not far from Manchester. This is coming in again. Another roach. Seriously. They want emptying. Another roach. What have they done to this game, man?
Yeah, there's some uh, some all right places in Cheshire. I used to fish um, a lake in a uh, place called Winterley, which is not far from Crewe. Uh, Winterley Pool on a carp syndicate there. And uh, that was some good fishing there, like. Which rods this too? Better, better than a two pound roach. Twenty one. That's the one, mate, next up main road. Uh road end is where they always f they feed all the swans and that. Yeah, yeah, fish fish that for a few years. Not been for a few years since, like. Biggest I've had out of there was like 23. Uh, mirror. It was alright because they used to let you use like bait boats on there, but saying that you you needed fish really close to the snags on opposite sides, so a bait boat was ideal, otherwise, you're in, you like getting snagged up all the time. Oh, you dog. Rod two got off. <laughs> yeah, I've fished Brookside as well. Is that the one with the uh, aerator in the middle? That kicks off, and when it kicks off, it sounds like a bomb going off it, water. One who fished it once, did a night on there like. Yeah, it scared me to death, man. When that kicked off, when you're in your bivvy and all's quiet, and then next minute, boof. <laughs> the mental defective link in formation. Ah, oh, Mr. Fox Plays, <laughs> thanks for the subscription, mate. Much obliged. Yeah, well, I think I only had some like a fifteen. I, uh, me and my mate, we didn't we didn't catch much like. It's supposed to be some big fish in it though, isn't there? I'm sure they said there was a thirty in it or something like that, unless it were just just bull to get people down fishing it. Nice one, mate. Yeah, it's a great game. Until they've uh, messed it up with these little roach. Don't know what they've done. Good fish, mate. 98 pound. I've had, uh, I've had Megalodon once so 151 but on xbox version 
So I'm currently playing on PC version. So I've not had not had Megalodon on PC yet. Oh, a tench, something different. Check it out. Not massive, but it's a, something different, isn't it? And that was on. 15 mil activate. Get him, mate. I got it the other week when it was released on that morning, and it was it had 25% off. So I got it, I think it was £6.74, something like that. It's probably gone up again now. Come on, where are these big fish? What do I want to catch? Anything bigger than these roach. Let's try them for the uh the boss fish. I've had six of the uh six of the twenty out of here so far. Yeah, I've uh well I started on PC. And then it was released on Xbox, so I switched to Xbox for a bit because it was nice playing it on a big, big TV. And then with all the issues that it was having, I just switched back to uh, PC. I had a new B new PC built recently, so I've got like a a decent desktop now. So I've come back to PC. So yeah, I've had it since on PC since it was like early access. Yeah, but because it didn't have float fishing at the beginning, did it? That was like an extra that they put in afterwards. What oh, is giving me such a scrap here? It's raining as well now, so hopefully that'll trigger the fish. Well, that's a bit better. It's a bit better. Twenty two common. Right. I like it. I like this lake when it goes like this when you get like the uh, mist on top of the water when it's raining. Looks cool. Hey Sam, how are you doing mate? Oh, what's going on here? Ah, uh, is it Polly's? Kings Down Road Flash? I fish that a lot mate. That's where it, where you're on about. 
full of carp. Not very deep. That's my uh I think it depends on No, it's not the one I'm thinking of then mate I'm not sure which one that is Near Platte Bridge. <laughs> Craig, thanks for for the subscription, mate. Much appreciated. Thanks very much, mate. Yeah, I play it all the time. Tell you what, whatever keeps picking that up keeps getting off. I think I need to move back so I can see. The alarms. There we go. Just hit that straight away. It's not getting off this time. It's coming straight in. Another roach. Should be putting these little roach in a bucket and using them as live bait. What is wrong on that rig? Yeah, definitely. Definitely, Craig. Get some pike in it. Just even if it was just like a separate lake from all the other species, like a predator lake on its own. Or pike and zander and perch. Let's put that one down. 
down, pick one up. Yes, so you could spin on it, yeah. suppose they've not gone down that route though because there's so many other fishing games out there that that's that's what you're doing it isn't it? Where you from Craig? Yeah, yeah. Are you a Trinity fan? This seems a bit heavier, whatever it is. The rain's just stopped as well. Went to a wedding once in Wakefield. Big like country, country ice. It was nice. Can't remember the name of it. I thought it was a bit heavier. All right, Craig, you take it easy, mate. Thanks for subbing, and uh, yeah, jump in again when I'm next next uh, streaming, mate. It could have been that, mate. It could have been that. No still priory. Hmm. Not sure if it was that. Beautiful place. on two what have we got here it's another roach it's a bit bigger is this a boss roach no three pound roach wouldn't mind if it was like a boss roach or something That was caught on once again. 15 mil activate sinker. 
I'm going to change it to the 18 mil. Is that, was that the 18 mil then? Yeah, see if we can get a boss one. I hope this is coming in easy. Another roach. Oh, tench. It's another tench. I was going to spod before when I got distracted. Right, let's spod that over there. Let's clip it up. Well... Best bit I've used for cats on here is has always been like um, have them dumbbells, them eighteen mil yellow dumbbells, or oh, by the um, or the big tiger nut. I've had like Megalodon and Cheetah, Puma, Lynx, all them. I to Bravo on Tiger Nut. Have you seen the underwater glitch? show it you shortly it's, it's a glitch it doesn't doesn't let you catch fish any better like but it does let you see um, what's under the water let me get these in and we'll go and I'll show you Doesn't work on here, it only works on uh, it only works on on uh, Presa del Monte Bravo. Might have enough points now anyway to Oh another roach. Um to get that twenty pound line. So we'll go back, I'll use the tackle points and then we'll go on Bravo and I'll show you what I'm on about. So what have I had? 29 fish, 250 pound. Right, let me use 
these points. I'm trying to unlock this line here, this 20 pound per, um, purple line. I want that one. But I'm going to have to work my way along to it, so let's get that one. So I need seven for that, and then some more. So let's go back. So what you do is you um, you spawn you teleport to this point here, and then if you walk down the bank as far as you can to the MPEG. Claim this peg. And now, what you need to do is you need to walk. Before I do, I'm going to cast out. Let's get some fish spawning in. So what you do is you walk round the back of your bivvy to this corner here and then start walking up the bivvy. You'll see it takes a little little while but it'll start walking up it. Sometimes it's easier if you fast walk. See, he's going up it. Right, I'm on top of my bivy now. Yeah. And then if you walk off this side here towards the damn wall. Go in the water. And then you walk down and you can walk along the bottom. So now we're under the... We're under the surface and you can see all contours of the lake. There's a few fish there swimming about. But if you do it with one of your mates and he's fishing, he'll while he's fishing he'll make the fish spawn. Spawn in. There's a cat there. Unfortunately, it only works on this lake. Be nice to see the bottom on all the lakes, but it only works for this one. So you can walk all along it. You can see the different different depths. Exactly. See, I normally fish to this big rock. I fish on the opposite side there near the uh, notice board. And I fish towards this big rock face, which is here. I think it's here. Is it this one? Yeah. I normally fish towards this. If the wind's blowing across this way, I fish it. I put my 
maybe just in front of this rock. So it's along this edge here. And you can see it's a bit shallower and then it drops off. So I normally cast towards this. So yeah, it's like pretty flat here. And then I'd sometimes put one of my rods, I'll cast it over into this little bay here because it's got like a gravel bottom. Yeah, yeah, it certainly does. So yeah, I'd normally put a rod here. Which has got a gravel spot there. There's a big tench, could side of that tench. So the w um, the wind's blowing up this way. So let's see if there's look at this here in the middle of the lake. There's like a rock. It's all that about. quite deep here yeah well I'm gonna oh there's one of the uh, boss fish check it out that big uh, big ghosty is it scar or something like that I'm got when I end this stream mate I'm gonna go and get some uh, some food not eating yet but yeah um, just add me on Steam. So let's have a look. Let's have a look down this channel. Now once you're in, you can't just walk out again. You can't walk onto the bank. You're like stuck in the water. Oh, I'm jumping. So what you've got to do is go up to one of the notice boards that's close to the edge and then you get the option to quick travel. Just click on quick travel and teleport to somewhere else and you back out the water. So this is where I was fishing earlier on. You can see it's quite deep. It just, just drops off the edge, doesn't it? Look at that. Bream. Tench over there, another tench. Like I said, I don't know how long it'll be before Dovetail patch it. They know about it. Um, one of the the uh, YouTubers, Big Buggy, he did a video with it the other day and. Um, dovetail. He didn't actually show you where you get in the water, but it showed like this view from underneath. So yeah, it's not like it, it, it lets you cheat in any way. There's no there's no advantage apart from you know what the bottom looks like where you normally fish to so if you've got your favorite peg and your favorite spot to cast to now you can see what the bottom's like where you cast into it it doesn't let you catch the fish any easier it just 
just lets you see where you're fishing to. That's weird, them rocks are like that. Floating like that, that's proper weird. Let's have a little loop down this, um, this other channel. Now I've had some big cats on. And I've also had the boss roach out of here down this down this little channel. Look at that there it overhangs. Like it goes underneath the rock. That's a little, it's like a little shelf there. In between. Where these rocks are here. So you can walk across it there. So that's really, really shallow. Ah, oh, cheers man. Just hit that subscribe button and uh, hit the bell as well. You'll get notified when I'm next streaming. Or if I upload a video. I'm in the process of catching boss fish. Once I've got a good few boss fish together, I'll, uh, I'll edit it and put all the boss fish out. So yeah, so you can't just walk out once you're in. Like that there. <laughs> the mental defective link. Oh, cheers, man. <laughs> you like stuck in the lake. So what I need to do is find one of these notice boards where I can get next to it. Yeah, I think there's like holes in the map somehow. It just drops off, doesn't it? That is definitely a glitch. It does that a lot on uh, St. John's. Drop there. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> the mental defective link. Robert, Informing. thanks, mate. Much appreciated. Oh, look, there's one of the boss cats. Check it out. They look mint how they move like under the water. Got great physics on the. Uh, oh, there's two. Look at that. Right, let's find a notice board and let's get out the water. So here's a here, this is a bay as well where it comes in. You can see the bottom's like all over the place here in this bit. Uh, I'm up. Let's walk around this edge. See, so you're like you're stuck. It's like a barrier. It's same when you're on the land, you can't just walk into the water. But we can get to this uh, notice board round here. Yeah, they, are, they do move like a tadpole, don't they? Big giant tadpole. So yeah, once you're stuck in, if you come up to this notice board here and you get your quick quick travel icon, just hit E and we're back out.
So this is where I was saying, um, I'll show you where I was, where I normally fish. Yeah, cheers man, I'll catch you again. So let me quick travel to here. I would normally fish to that rock there, but the wind's actually blowing down that end. Try it with a go. So have a few minutes on here, then I'm going to call an end to the stream for tonight. Because I need some food. Here we go. Rod one's going.
this going to be? It's putting up a scrap. That's another carp. Twenty six, nice. We'll get a few more before I uh, call it a day because I'm on the verge of leveling up again. Take me up the lake. Go on. Let's have a boss. Let's end on a boss. I do, mate. Yes, yeah, Marty. Um, certainly do. Do a bit of carp fishing and a bit of float fishing for pleasure. When I can't be bothered carrying all the uh, the heavy carp gear, I just take a float rod. Do a bit of coarse fishing. Need to switch the light on. It's gone a bit dark in here now. Sun's going down. Uh, 23 pound mirror, mirror carp. I've had a couple of uh, 20 pound commons as well. Now what's this? What is this? It's a nice fish, isn't it? That'd be nice in real life. That's 20 plus. Ooh, 30 pounder. I think that's the biggest fish that I've had. No, I had um, Fat Boy earlier on, which is 52. Yeah, it's nice. Nice fish. That'd be nice in real life, wouldn't it? Be made up with that. Let's put that one back out there. Too hard. Too hard. Let's reset two. Two seems to have moved. Oh, nice one, Daniel. 
Is he a, is he a leather? I've not had him for a while. Can't remember. We've just had a 30 out of here, but it was unnamed. What time is it? Oh, God, it's 20 past nine. I had Fat Boy out of here earlier. He's uh, he weighs fifty two. I think that's the first time I've had him on PC, I'm not sure. We're we'll checking a minute. Oh, here we go, rub one. Right, I'm going to go back to main menu, and I'm going to call it a night. Tackle shop. Oh, I need more points yet. To unlock these lines. Need that purple line. Right, thanks everyone for joining, for watching, and for subscribing. And uh, I'll be back on probably tomorrow evening range seven o'clock um for a couple of hours so if you want to join me then i should be back on then if not i'll catch you all again soon cross it over and out see you later guys